Alright guys, what is up? It's been a while since I've <coughs> made a video on here. Um, I just wanted to talk about my current state of... Why does my beard look like that? Anyways, my current state of uh, wearables. So, I have my Apple Watch Ultra on. Um, I did realize after a while that I needed to use both my Whoop and my Apple Watch Ultra. I like to have the screen to see what my metrics are when I'm running or lifting or whatever. Um, so, I, I use both and I use both often. I actually started using just the armband on the Whoop. I felt kind of weird wearing both. Um, I already wear, wear a bunch of bracelets on one of my um, <coughs> For one of my wrists you guys can hear Cooper back there um, and I gotta be honest I stopped using my loop for a while and just used athletic which is an app that's on my on my on my on my Apple watch and I really do like athletic I pay about thirty dollars a month instead of thirty dollars uh, I'm sorry I pay thirty dollars a year instead of thirty dollars a month like for whoop um, and I really like athletic and it does give me some good data I just don't think the HRV algorithm or whatever it is that sends the data to the um, athletic app is as is accurate enough to base my recovery on what I mean by that is so when my whoop says that I'm you know half recovered I feel half recovered. I feel like, you know, maybe I have enough energy to get a, somewhere, somewhat of a workout in, but not a full workout. And when Athletic says I'm fully recovered, sometimes I feel really tired. Now, I know these devices can't tell you exactly how you feel. Um, that would be a little bit impossible um, for them to do. But the Whoop is definitely a lot more accurate, in my opinion, when it comes to um, recovery. Now, the one thing caveat that I do have to that is I don't think, and, and obviously it probably makes sense, Apple's been in the game for longer, but I don't think that the Whoop straps heart rate is nearly as accurate as um, the Apple Watch. Um, now, when I'm sitting, just standing still and you, and using them both at the same time, say, say I'm just looking at the heart rate on both, they're both pretty much the same. But once you start moving around, whether it's lifting weights, with, with, lifting weights which, you know, uh, wearables have a hard time with anyways, then I, I've noticed um, the whoop is all over the place. You know, it takes a while to catch on to my heart rate and say, oh, this was a spike in heart rate or a drop in heart rate. And I know wearables just have that problem anyway. But my Apple Watch is a lot more accurate. So, with that being said, though, I would still use Whoop if I was uh, somebody that was really concerned with either overtraining or um, maybe even pushing themselves even further. Because the nice thing about Whoop too is it tells you, hey, you can still work a little bit harder um, and meet your exertion goals for the day. Athletic has the same type of thing in in the app. But again, not quite as accurate. I do think Athletic will get better over time, but right now, Whoop, you know, Whoop's whole thing is, you know, track and recovery. I think the, the tracking workouts is kind of secondary. And what I mean by that is, it's more to help you know how recovered you are and to let you realize how hard you can work to, and still get fully recovered. I'm not sure if that makes any sense, but that's my opinion on, on what Whoop does. So, um, I'll continue to use my Whoop and my Apple Watch, which seems like overkill for most people. Um, but I do find that the data within both correlating with each other and, you know, using some data from the Apple Watch, some data from the Whoop, I feel like that really um, gives me the data that I'm looking for. Um, now, obviously, there are some days where I don't feel like I'm recovered and it says I am recovered and you know I can push myself or some days I just give myself the rest but 
that being said, I think Whoop is only getting better. They do have that new whole AI tool built in where you can ask it questions and my understanding is it will actually look at your data and give you answers based on your data plus some you know artificial intelligence, which is a real cool feature. Um, and you know, the accessories and stuff are just getting better and better. The shirts, you can slide the whoop um, sensor in, the stra arm straps, the shorts, whatever, you know. But um, it's also awesome that it's kind of a Boston-based company. I'm from Massachusetts. When you're in Fenway, you can look out and see the big whoop building, which is very cool. So, you know, it's 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 definitely a product that I, I talk about even in class when I'm talking about wearables or certain things in IT. I know that, you know, that's reaching a little bit, but. So, I don't know, if you, if you want to, check out Whoop. Also, check out the Athletic app. It, uh, you can use that with any watch. Um, I think I'm gonna start making a lot more videos on here just because I, I, I buy a lot of tech stuff and I, I feel like I wanna scream at the top of my lungs about half the stuff just to tell people about it because I'm excited. So, hopefully I start making some more videos. So, subscribe to this if you want. And I know this was kinda all over the place, but you know, give it a, give it a, give it a shot. Um, and maybe you'll like some of my videos and maybe you'll like, uh, the, thanks.